the season's coming to an end. There's only three weeks left to a month left, and uh, oh man, it's kind of it's crazy. I've been here for a while, you know. A lot, a lot has happened, um, and I'm a completely different person than <laughs> than the person I was when I first got here. Like, if you even see in the videos, you know that like, I'm still trying to go about things, and I'm still like, on, you know, on my process, on my journey, but. I'm a completely different person, like mentally, physically, like even as a footballer, like straight up, I'm just so much better. I'm just grateful for everything. Um, and it's kind of surreal that I've almost been here for a year. Um, I have a lot of great memories and now I'm preparing for trials. So I'm gonna be doing my first professional trials. I'm not gonna say where, just, you know, I'm not gonna say that right now, but yeah, I'm gonna be doing my first trials and right now is like a very important time for me to get there mentally and focus um and i know i'm ready i know i'm ready i put in so much work i have no doubt in my ability you know um so i know it's gonna i know it's gonna be it's gonna go really well so i just tell you that because i probably won't be posting on social media at all i've already deleted instagram so if you reach out to me for the next month i won't be able to get back to you um still reach out to me still follow me on there because I'll, I'll be posting updates to the trial on instagram but yeah i'm gonna be taking a break from social media which youtube as well so i'm excited um i just want to let you guys know that um even i have even i have doubts sometimes in myself you know every player has doubts and they suffer with confidence sometimes, you know, even outside of football, it's just in life in general, you know, you have, you have moments in life where you're doubting yourself and you're comparing yourself to other people um, and you don't feel, you know, you know, you don't feel valuable in certain aspects. If I could say something that could help you individually in your life, doesn't matter what you're doing. If you're a footballer, if you're a basketball player, um, if you're a swimmer, if you're a business person, if you're a student, doesn't matter. Um, this applies for everything. Make sure you're getting your self-worth from the right place. And there's one place where it's the perfect place. And I'm, I'm realizing that now and like it's a gradual process, but I'm starting to see that m my self-worth is not determined on what other people think about me. Um, or what a specific person says about me or what a coach uh, thinks I am. That doesn't matter. I know what God says I am. He says I'm a masterpiece. I mean, it's written. He says that I can do all things through him. So why should I have any doubt? Why, why should I have any doubt in myself? Why should I not value myself? Why should I not give self, give self love to myself? when God calls me a masterpiece, when he says I'm made in his image. Um, you know, so make sure you're getting your your worth from the right places. When you look in the mirror, you're looking through, through the right lens. You're not looking through the lens of other people. You know, and I, I've, had, I've, had, I've had issues with that in the past, you know, but yeah, I would just say that. Um, I know it's everywhere. Um, my emotions are, you know, I'm not going to go into that. I know it's everywhere, yeah. But I'm excited for this time. I'm excited for you guys to see. I have a lot of big plans for the summer for you guys to help you guys. I'm just so blessed and thankful. So keep walking by faith and not by sight. Remember what that means. That means that regardless of what anyone else says, you can see your vision when other people can't. And you're willing you can take the risk of taking those steps when you can't see but you know so i'll see you guys in a little while